This video will show you how to create DLLs or also named dynamic link libraries using Visual C Plus 2008. These libraries usually have the file extension DLL. To start, click on File New Project and then select Win32 Console Application. We will name this formulas. Click Next, and then select DLL. When done click on Finish. Here in Formulas CPP you will write all your functions that will be recognized when you will call them from other applications. First we'll define a type which will show what function will be accessed from outside. Remember this line. From now on. All functions that we will create for outside use will have DLL in front, followed by the type of variable it returns. Because in Dark GDK the DLL functions returns only D word, we will also declare this function as a D word. For this tutorial, we will create a simple function that returns the sum result of two variables. We have to include Dark GDK library because that's where the D word is declared. Now let's compile and build the DLL. Here is the DLL library we created. Let's copy it. Now. Let's create a dark GDK application that uses the DLL we created. Select File New Project Wizard Dark GDK Game. Now let's load our DLL but not before we copied our DLL in this applications folder. In the DB load DLL requires two parameters. One is the name of the DLL and another is its ID. Here we will just type 1, because it's our first DLL loaded. Make sure you have updated Dark GDK because the first release has some mistakes at the DLL libraries. Instead of constant char it required a D word as a parameter. Remember that DB call DLL function returns D word so you have to store the result in a D word variable. We will declare a D word variable named result1 and an integer variable named result2. Result 1 will store the return of the DLL call function with the following parameters, sum, the name of function, and the parameters for A and B, 12 and 13. Result 2 will store the value of result 1 converted to int. Now let's see if the DLL returns the correct value of 12 plus 13. There you are, 12 plus 13 equals 25. I hope this tutorial helped you. My name is Ivona, thanks for watching.